Hello. Hello. How are you? Here's your property. Mm -hmm. and <clears throat> Where was she arrested at? Uh, Maryville High School. Maryville High School? Yeah, the football game. Okay. You guys need three, right? Yes. How do you say your first name? Ariana. Ariana. Okay, I was saying it right. There you go. <clears throat> no, we didn't have a female on duty, so she was before we it down. Okay, yeah, we'll do that here anyways. Okay, I need you to take her handcuffs off. Stand up. Put your hands up off your back. Um, what do you have on in your hair? Rubber bands. Can you take them off for me? Just sign right here, right here. Oh, yeah, are you signed there? <clears throat> I'm gonna do a pat down search on her, and I need you to look while I okay. do that, okay? Put these handcuffs in the front. Oh, she can stay right here. I'm going to handcuff you to the counter. I'm going to need you to stand like this with your legs spread. Bring your legs towards me. Keep on going. Did you need these? All right. Have a seat for me. Okay, you're done. All right, thank you. Mm -hmm. So you've been here before, right? So you know that what I'm doing is intake. I'm just going to ask you basic questions. I'm not going to go into details about what you did. Uh, do you understand you're on probation? So this kind of looks bad on you. Um, have you spoke to your probation officer? No. You were just here, right? Not too long ago? You were released on June 31st? You had a seven-day commitment? 
seven day commitment? Yeah. August. August. So July, July, June. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna need you to keep, um, have you keep your head up while I do this intake. All right. What kind of problems were you having at Maribel? Fights. Fights. Mm -hmm. Suspensions. And do you feel better now that you're going to Campania? Is it helping you? Um. Are you um, going through any counseling? Are you a 10th grader at Campania? Yeah. Okay. Did you want to speak with your mom? When was the last time you took any drugs or alcohol? A year and a half ago, what did you take? What did you use? Marijuana. All right, this is consent to release information. This is something you already know if you're placed on probation, which you already are in probation. The probation officer will obtain background information on you. That includes school records. Um, if you've seen a therapist, they will also obtain that information. Um, if you want to read, if not, you can sign here at the bottom. <coughs> He seems like very angry. Are you mad right now? Why? You don't think this is right that you're arrested or? You were at a football game, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. With your friends, who were you with? I was with my friend. I was waiting for my mother to get there. So, so only since I didn't attend the school, I couldn't go. Oh, I see. But you decided to go anyways. Mm -mm. I was looking for my brothers. And the principal had the police come over there. I was trying to talk to my brother, and he kept pulling me back. I mean, I, I understand your frustration, you know? So hopefully in this case, you know, the court, <clears throat> I don't know what the court's gonna decide since you're already on probation. It will be pretty much up to the probation officer. You know, they, they give their recommendation. Um, but you said you've been doing good, you've been attending school, you haven't been doing any drugs, which is a good thing. Court also is going to see that side that you've been doing what you're supposed to do. Um, and you said you wanted to speak with your mom, right? What number should I call her on? Hi, is this Diane Perry? Yeah. This is Lake County Juvenile Center. Calling in regards to your daughter, Ariana Buchanan. She was brought in by the Maryville Police Department for disorderly conduct and she will have her detention hearing on Monday at 8.30 in the morning. Would you be able to attend? Yes? I guess so. Is it right at 8.30? Um, you should be here actually by 8.15 because you have to sign some paperwork. Okay. All right. So you will attend? Yeah. Okay. She wanted to speak with you, okay? All right. Go ahead. Hello? Yeah. Huh? Hello? You came up here? Yes, I did. I told you I had to wait till Monday. You said that they might let you go in an hour, but she said Monday. 
Yeah. Who, t who told you that she'll be able to go in an hour? The police officer in Maryville. No, um, your daughter's already on probation. I so, understand. So um, that's one of the reasons why she can't go home today. She's going to have to stay for her detention hearing. Um, I did show him the video that I took. He was in agreement with me that that was just wrong, so I don't have any worry about it. But I can't bring the video in from the camera into LCJC. Right. Okay, go ahead. Okay. 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 Right. Monday morning. Um, Ma. Hello. Is yours okay? Ma. Oh, no. Do not. No. Try, try, try. Huh? No, he'll be all right. Okay. I'll see you on Monday. All right. No. Are we done? Harry. Yeah. Just behave. Okay. Right? Yeah. I love you. I love you too. Miss Perry? Yes. Is your daughter any type of counseling? Might once she does this, Okay, so you will be looking into that? Yeah. Okay. Because I think that would help her a lot. Yeah, I see. I really see it up. Yeah. She seems like a very, you know, young, good young lady, but she just made bad choices, but doesn't mean she's a bad person. She might just need some guidance right now. Yeah. So we'll see you on Monday? Okay. Okay. Yeah. Is that your younger brother? How old is he? Eleven. Eleven years old. Is he upset right now because you're arrested? Yeah. Was he with you guys? Yeah. Oh, so he had to see the whole thing. Yeah. I'm sure, that was really hard on on your mom, especially. Um, finish signing all the paperwork, right? Okay, the dress code policy, you already know about this for future court dates. You have to look appropriate for court.